Jesus. Hallelujah. The Bible says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, but have everlasting life. Jesus Christ is the Son of God. He died on the cross for sinners and rose from the dead. And God commands all people everywhere to repent. To repent and believe in the Son of God. God is good and God is infinite. God is a good God. He's a loving God and He loves the world and He showed His love when He sent Jesus. You know what God says in the Bible? When God destroyed the world in Noah's day by flood, 40 days and 40 nights it rained. You know God made a covenant with Noah and the whole earth in Genesis 9 that he would no longer destroy the world by flood. So that's why God put the rainbow in the cloud. So whenever it rains and you see the rainbow appears after a shower, after the rain, remember this, it is God's covenant. The rainbow is a covenant that God has given to man the world, that he would not destroy the world by flood. Genesis chapter 9, read the Bible, you'll see it. But some people or some organization have hijacked, hijacked the rainbow for their trademark. But the rainbow tells us God, Jehovah, exists. Hallelujah. The rainbow tells us God exists. That there is a God and He's watching the earth and He knows about everyone and everything. So if you read the Bible, you'll see where God put the rainbow in the cloud which demonstrate His covenant with the world. That's why the world, the whole world won't be destroyed by flood anymore. You'll get certain parts of the world that will be destroyed by flood, but not the whole world because of God's promise. But in 2 Peter chapter 3, God says He will destroy the earth by fire, not by flood, not by water, but by fire. Everything in this earth is going to be burned up by fire. Second Peter 3, the elements and everything in the earth are going to be burned up by fire. So God, who is holy, commands everyone everywhere to repent, repent, turn from ungodliness, turn from wickedness, turn from sin, turn to God. Only God is good and God is infinite. Hallelujah. And God is love. And God is calling sinners to repent. To repent is to turn from your way to God's way. And Jesus says, I am the way, the truth and the life. Hallelujah. Jesus is coming soon. We are living in the last days. The end is near. The coming of the Lord is near. That's why you're seeing all these things taking place in the world. Jesus says, as it was in the days of Noah, so it's going to be before his second coming. Noah's day, they were drinking, they were mocking, 
They were living in sin, ungodly, had no care about Noah and the ark, and the flood came and destroyed them all. Only eight souls were saved. Noah and all the animals that went into the ark. Jesus says it's going to be like the days of Sodom and Gomorrah before the second coming. The world is going to get like Sodom. This is it now. That's what you're seeing. What the Bible says. So Jesus says these things are going to take place in the last days. So you need to know what time you're in. Repent. Believe in Jesus. Call on the Lord Jesus Christ and be saved. Hallelujah. God loves you. Jesus died for you. And God is calling you to believe in Jesus. Hallelujah. Give your life to Jesus Christ. Give your life to Jesus Christ today. If you die without Jesus Christ, you'll go to hell. Hallelujah. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Give your life to Jesus Christ. He is the way, the truth, and the life. There is no other way.